Hey guys, so I've begun playing a bit more survival, well, trying to get serious about it at least. And, and I've come up with these. Uh, basically, it's the same idea as the big ship I was trying to make with the exchangeable heads, um, just on a small scale. I still need to make a combat version and a mining version of these. But so far, I am pretty satisfied with it. Um, basically what I got here is I got a welder head and a grinder head and the um, ship itself has all the engines and the power and the gyros etc while the attachable part has all the logistics, the conveyors and stuff but nothing else than that so this one head is made up of three welders, three medium car containers Two bent convey, three bent conveyor tubes, and um, a conveyor and a connector. Um, basically, this saves me from having to build multiple ships, and also gives me a small, fast ship to move around in if I have to go another place in the system. Um, while saving the mat th me the materials and the time of building three ships which I of course could have done instead of building a big one but yeah it's an idea and I think it's it's working pretty well um, what I'm doing in survival currently is I'm building a base uh, up until now I've been using this ship and floating around in it um, But now I've decided to settle down, as it were. <coughs> um, and I am just. I've just been making enough materials to make four refineries. Uh, I think I'm pulling. No, I'm not pulling enough up for. The idea here right now is that I'm going to pull enough materials up to build one of them just to do a quick demonstration. And I need to come up with a way to transfer this, these materials much more effectively than I'm doing right now because this is just weak. Um, so yeah, yeah. Okay, there should be enough inside the ship to do one. Um, but yeah. They are, well, it's the merge, so it's working as if it was one ship, so there's nothing to bounce about and lack while doing multiplayer, uh, so that's not really a concern. The only thing one has to be, um, be, 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 um, what's that called? One thing you have to watch is uh, that if you built something like this you have to make sure that you have enough thrust power on your ship to pull the extra weight and of course enough gyroscopic power uh, originally I only have one gyro on this uh, but it simply couldn't turn it quickly enough inside the structures so I was banging against walls and stuff like that um, so yeah keep that in mind and as you can see, using a welder on a ship, well, if you use three of them because they can work together on one part, uh, that's just much faster. That's also a thing. Um, if I pull up <coughs> to, for example, two large blocks, I can get all three welders to work on those two blocks. So this is uh, even on one, or even when you're working on one or two blocks, this is much faster than doing it manually no matter what people say about welder and grinder speed I love it um, so yeah I think that's about all I got for now I'm not going to do let's play or anything at the moment at least uh, but if that the, if that would be an interesting thing please say in the comments and I'll look into it so yeah that's basically it little nifty modular design um, yeah, thank you for watching and see you around.